Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to this short overview of the tournament. We are now uh, at the knockout stage. All the group stage match is done. So I'm just going to show you in this video, I'm going to run over the final standings in the group and then I'm going to show you the tournament, the knockout table, the tournament table for the knockout phase. And um, then I'm going to show you the, uh, the overall goal scorer so far, you know, you know, from the group stage to so see who's the leading goal scorer as we go. Um, so group one, as you can see, um, Wadet, Casablanca, and Africa Sport of Abidjan will be going through Orlando Paris and Al Ali. They are not going to make it, so too bad. The club of the century, Al Ali of Egypt, is not going to make it. So um, let's go to the next group, group two. We're going to see Iyimba of Nigeria and Asante Kotoko of Ghana going through. And Zesco and GS Kabila will not make it through. In group three, we have Accra Hearts of Oak of Ghana and Mama Lodi Sundowns. Uh, going through, Esperancy and MC Archer will not make it. Um, and the next game that you will see Mamelodi Sundown playing, you are going to see them in uh, official kits and everything. So um, the next home and away match, you're going to see the home kit and away kit. So uh, I finally got somebody sent me uh, the kit and I uploaded it here, so you will see that. So that's that. Um, group four, we have Haifa Hafia Hafia FC of uh, Guinea going through. I mean, I think you need to watch out for these guys, man. They are, they are some, some, ooh, they, they are, they are lethal, man. Um, high, high fire FC, they impressed me so far. Maybe the group are easy, I don't know. But I don't think it was because they have some very good teams here. Um, but then, uh, so they're going to go through along with Invisible 11. So these two teams, uh, watch out for them in, in the knockout stage. And uh, Vita Club and Club African uh, will not make it. Um... Ashanti Go in Group Five is going through, top in the group, followed by Castle Chief. So Castle Chief and Ashanti Go will go through, um, uh, and uh, Nima United and TP Mazembe is not going to make it. In Group Six we have Zamalek, the White Knight of Egypt, going through with Cotton Sports of Cameroon, Esatif and Maida Baro, no way for them. Um, uh, we we'll go to Group Seven we have Tonier Club of Cameroon and Raja Casablanca of. Uh, Morocco making it through, and the Bra Young Controllers and Amarek are not going to make it. And uh, in uh, Group Eight, we have Atolis Petit Sahel and Ria Bamako. Oh, Ria, um, yeah, because the game draws, like we said in the, like I said in the last match, that uh, Ria Bamako needed a draw, and that's what happened between they needed a draw between State Abidjan and Asec, and that's exactly what happened. So they pray well, and uh, they are going to go through to the knockout stage, you know, with Atol uh, Petit Sahel of uh, Tunisia. So uh, that's that for the group stage. That's the final standing. Let's look at the tournament table for the knockout phase. So we see this is the first set of matches uh, in the tournament from the, in the knockout stage. So uh, we have Zamalek's going to take on Asante Kotoko of Ghana. So Zamalek of Egypt and Asante Kotoko. That's the white net and the porcupines. Um, we're going to have uh, Africa Sports Ab the Abidjan of, Ar uh, in, of Aracos going against the Yemba of Nigeria. We're going to have Wade Casablanca going of uh, is it Morocco, yes, going against uh, Cartoon Sports of Cameroon. And the Ria Bamako of Mali is going to take on Turnier Clara Club of, the, uh, of Cameroon. So um, I think Ria Bamako and Turnier Clara Club was in the same group, right? So they're going to uh, face each other again. Uh, that's, that's interesting. Um, we have uh, Tony Sahel of uh, Tunisia taking on Invisible 11 of Liberia. Um, so only one Liberian team qualified. Uh, we have, I think, two Ghanaian, actually three, no, is it three? Let me see. I mean, yeah, we got three Ghanaian teams. So all the Ghanaian teams are qualified. Asante Go, Asante Kodoko, Accra has a vote, all qualified. We have, uh, an Egypt, one Egyptian team. We have, uh... Yeah, so one Liberian team, and but we're gonna see Castle Chief of South Africa. We have two South African team qualifying to this knockout stage. So Castle Chief is gonna take on of, of South Africa is gonna take on Asante Gold of uh, Ghana, and we're gonna have uh, Accra Hearts of Oak taking on Raja Casablanca of Morocco, and the Hearts of Oak is of Ghana, and Mamalodi Sundown, the current holder of this cup, is uh, taking on Haifa FC of uh, Guinea. This is going to be an interesting uh, 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 match between these two, uh, Sundowns and Haifa. And that's a match I really want to see how that will end up. Um, well, we'll see. Um, will Lafayette stand up to the chances? And I have, and again, another thing about Sundowns, not only do I have the kits, but I also have all the players' names. 
I guess correctly. I'm not sure, but I guess some people on the on social media will probably disagree with me. But as far as I'm concerned, I think yeah, that's the best I could get. So yes, yeah, so stay tuned, you know, and let's go look at who's the leading goal scorer right now. Who is the leading goal scorer? We have Wea. That's no surprise there, George. Wea of the Invisible Eleven is the leading goal scorer so far with five goals, followed by uh, a Tony Spotil Sahel Agri with three and uh, State Abidjan Mar Masura with three goals. So um, there you go, your, the three top three goal scorer so far in the competition. So. Um, Let's see what happens, and we can look at the assist ranking if you want. Um, we got uh, at the beginning of Sahel and leading the assist with three, and it Henrik of Haifa and Helda Tavares of Mama Lodi Sundown with two. Funny though, because since since I don't know if the player since I did the upload and the lineup for Mama Lodi Sundown, I don't know whether the name was still the same. So uh, for you Sundown fans out there, I'm sorry because I updated your lineup to your real player names and stuff. So the stats here, I guess, will kind of be skewed, you know, to your to not to your favor um, because of the changes in the name. But I did a good thing, and you're gonna see your real player names and stuff. So, um, but that's it. Thank you again for joining me. Stay tuned as we go to the next match, which is gonna be the first match in this Zanaka State between Zamalek and Asante Kotoko. So you take care. See you in Egypt. Bye bye.